kind of like spooky videos. So I think this is just like from their entire year. Um, Cause they, they do like a weekly kind of like a daily dose of memes, but it's like daily dose of fucking spooky shit. <laughs> I'm already scared. Yeah. Yeah. It's let's, let's see. I did not, um, I did not look over this before Bob. No, bub, but bizarre bub. But yeah, they're 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 known for uploading a lot of like paranormal stuff, so they they can be trusted. Um, all right, let's see. I did not watch any of this beforehand, so I don't know what's in this. Um, I guess he did like a big countdown, so this is just like. The following footage was posted by Vanessa Belen, one. who had caught something disturbing Maybe. on her doorbell camera. Vanessa writes. First. I grew up in a haunted home with paranormal investigators and priests constantly coming to my house, so I don't get that scared easily. But oh, last no, night, no, no. Yeah. I saw this through my ring camera at 11:30 p.m., and it was the only ring time that I truly felt scared. Ring cameras are never going to show you something good. This is what she'd seen. I should see. Be sure to look closely. I don't or want you'll to. Miss it. I don't want to look closely. I will look unclosely. What's that? The Halloween decoration. Is it gonna move? Don't move. I like how it's like, look closely or you'll a miss faint it. Image like of what appears to be a face can be seen hiding behind the flowers. It's hard to make out what this is. I mean, it looks fucking terrifying for sure. Except for that time a bumblebee triggered the ring camera. Only good time. Literally only good time. Definitely a water drop like, like yeah, it's or something is looking at the doorbell camera. But as always. I'll let you decide yeah, it as looks to what like this might that, be. or just like a Halloween what exactly decoration that's just like camera? terrifying and looks like a fucking potato, but <laughs> yeah, I don't know. It's the middle of the night, oh. and old Deject is on his phone. What's when that? something downright creepy happens. Why do you have that in your in room? In the corner of his room, that's, there's a doll. That's what you get for having the Jigsaw doll in your room. I don't care what happens to you in this video. You have brought that upon right. yourself. I was you brought on that my phone upon yourself. I'm sorry. When I heard something. This it's like a paper mache head. Caught. That too, that too. Yes, they are, actually. What is happening here? What type of what's what's going on? Is it gonna fall over? It's gonna turn its head? Hold on. Hold on. Oh, he moved his shoulder a little bit. Oh, he's shimmying. Is he on a Roomba? Did they put the jigsaw on the Roomba? No. Oh, it literally is falling over. It's literally just a doll falling over. Stop. Also, but what do you expect when you put that in your room? Like, it is going to look creepy in the corner. Like, it's not going to look great. It's not a good decor if you want to feel safe. Um, But yeah, on that topic of humans uh, being hardwired to see faces... I think that's why like doppelgangers are so disturbing is because like you are it's very like alarming and unsettling to know that there's something out there someone out there that may look very similar to you in, in like a weird sense so like that's also it's just kind of a like oh, this isn't this isn't normal yeah you did this to yourself the also doll please to move by itself it fell now, it could be that gravity was responsible for this yes but whether I mean, or not this was something paranormal, the video is still nonetheless pretty creepy. Why would you have a toddler-sized jigsaw doll in your room? A dog I just and her owner know. are both home alone when the oh, following happens. When dogs get involved, the owner no. who posted the video writes, "Hazel has been growling for ten minutes." Ugh, I checked when animals the get involved to in see general. if someone was outside, yeah, but there wasn't. Sure. So I decided to record her, as this isn't her normal behavior. This so you should be caught. alarmed that your dog senses something. That's why. I rebuke you in the name of Jesus Christ. Oh my God. Please. This is totally my mom. This is totally my mom. <laughs> I love my mom that she would definitely do this. I rebuke you. Satan, get behind me. She doesn't have a southern accent. I don't know why I gave her that. 
Like, if your dog is acting up, that means something is up. Right? Like, you would take heed. I would not be in my bed. Oh, my God. No, no, no. Uh-uh. What no. is Hazel seeing? And what might be the reason as to why she's growling? Hazel saw some shit. It's believed that dogs can see things such as entities that we can't. I mean, they definitely sense something. But I'll something. let you decide as to whether or not she's actually right? seeing something. As always. That dog got to let me know what you think. panicked. And it's interesting because they didn't attack. A garment factory they just in got Japan scared. has been experiencing strange activity. Oh, here it we go. It was just recently that the factory's surveillance cameras had caught footage of the strange things that have been happening. When the owner of the factory had seen the footage, I know, he was poor shocked. Hazel. But he wasn't shocked for the reason you're probably that thinking. You're seeing it all. The factory owner himself best explains the footage that was captured. Take a look. Oh no. Oh. Imagine dying and then your ghost haunts your work. That sucks. I, if I'm dead, my ghost better not. Oh, that so machine is moving. I know the chat's kind of hiding that a little bit, but you can see. Uh. That's... Oh no. That sucks. She literally like just wants. Does she does she like sewing maybe? I don't know. Right? That sucks. If I die and my ghost shows up to work. Scared of this mannequin. Oh no, don't. She's like. <laughs> That's too much movement. That's too much movement. I don't like it. Mannequins are creepy. Where's it going? <laughs> Those are gonna go the like warp through the wall. <laughs> that if the ghost of Miss Tanaka is behind all these strange go, occurrences, right? then it isn't necessarily bad. After all, Miss Tanaka seems to be truly missed by her co workers. Aww. These strange occurrences are probably the closest sweet. thing to having Miss Tanaka around. One I feel more bad time. that her ghost shows up at work, but I don't know. Maybe she likes to show the up there. The following segment features a set of videos of strange occurrences that have taken place inside a home. Very little information is given on these videos, that? but each one speaks for itself. Each video was shot in a room where most of the activity takes place. On a potato, it apparently. It is for this reason that oh, a camera was placed inside that. to capture it's these strange occurrences. However, it seems that with each occurrence, the activity gets worse. Out of all incidents, Time to move the out. fifth occurrence is probably the creepiest. Time to move this out. This is what was captured. <gasps> oh, shit. <laughs> I thought that was the ghost. I was like, damn, it looks lifelike. <laughs> I got so freaked out. Oh, God. Uh, I was like, why does that ghost look so much like a person? That's a little bit too much. Um, no. Well, that just, hold on. Now that just looks like something that, okay, well then, I don't know. Should be fallen. Capture from a different angle. Do they like have construction happening around them? Yeah, the first one was definitely just something falling over because you sh shut the door. Okay, well, that's not how gravity works. I think. I got, I'm not an expert. Now that's just. Oh, the light bulb. Ooh. When light bulbs explode, that really freaks me out. That really freaks me out when that happens. Yeah, yeah, that one. Why is some, an occurrence happening to them? Uh-oh, not the laundry. It's the last occurrence Excuse that's me? hard to explain. Somehow, the garment in the basket appears to throw itself into the washer. It looks like a it head. It could be that the video is playing in reverse making it seem as though it threw itself in when it actually right. fell into the basket. Right. But she walked if the by? video wasn't reversed, it doesn't explain how the laundry fell into the it basket on its own. It looks creepy still. 
viewers can seem to explain this Ms. final Tanaka clip. Mr. Tanaka is everywhere. Well, what do you think? He's like, I'm doing the laundry. guy has been caught on camera. I don't even go or here. was this something else? I don't know. General Shim is resting on his rooftop when he sees something that leaves him terrified. Oh, General no. General Shim writes, I just wanted to loiter on my house's rooftop <laughs> because the breeze there is soothing and fresh. I'm sorry. I just love that he starts off saying that he's loitering on his own property. Bro, that's your house. You're not loitering on your rooftop. You just want to fucking be on the roof. Don't be a don't, don't don't be a fucking cop to yourself. Like I know you're a general and everything, but like calm down. But little did I know that someone else would be there with me. <laughs> right? I'm like this is what he you're saw. Not loitering. Just want to be on the roof. What'd you see? Oh. What? Hold on. General Shim hopes that, that this was just a coconut on a tree. That's not a coconut. But what do you see? Could this be a case of pareidolia? Or Maybe. An actual sinister. Where you want to see entity? the face? I mean, it just looks kind of fucked up. I think we can agree either way. It's still a kind of fucked up looking photo. That no, that's not a coconut. There is no uh, shiny irises of a co of a coconut. Yeah, honestly, just say you want to have a beer outside and chill. Yeah, it was really weird to tell how that one was. A family I, I buys a doll from a thrift store, but oh. ever since buying it, there's been nothing but strange occurrences. A family taking buys place a doll home. from a thrift they store. They believe that the doll is haunted and is therefore responsible for the strange activity that's been happening. So from do they toys still turning have on it? by themselves. Well, that's batteries. Okay, own. that's not anything. The family is stuck in a that's house not. that they believe is haunted. The family has not a no haunted idea thrift store doll. We Haven't we learned? The activity. But then one day, oh. a friend of the family suggested that they light a white candle by the doll in the hopes that oh, doing so would stop the Oh, don't try to do. No, no. They I just, just feel like that's bad to do. I feel like that's bad to do. Um. I don't fuck with that. I, if I'm not tr gonna try to like magic a spirit out of some place, like pfft. that, but something very strange happens. The family sets up a camera in front of the doll. She blows the candle. Anything unusual that happens. This the house catch on fire because you put a candle next to a fucking plastic doll. I'm sorry, I'm roasting these people too much. Yeah, you gotta trim your wick, idiot. Yeah, trim your wick. The candlelight mysteriously gets brighter. Because you fucked up your candle. unfortunately, can <laughs> right? this had no effect on the strange activity. I'm sorry. Things only appear to get worse. You almost caught your house on but fire. But one day, um, the strangest incident happens. That was weird. The daughter is playing with the doll, and the following is caught on camera. That's a big-ass doll! I'm sorry! That doll is the size of that child. That's fucking terrifying. I don't know. Yikes. Filthy casual candle burners. I I, pff, I will drag you. All right. I don't like where this is going, though. Slap sound. Does she get bit? Did they? Wait. If you listen closely, you can almost hear what sounds like a slap. You can see the arm. <gasps> Why do you can see the, the arm moving on the left? She was hurt. You see that? But what do you think? Dude, is he not going to point it out? Her, or was it something else? Ooh, I don't know. I don't like it. Regardless, Kate posted the following video. Regardless, don't thrift store doll. Okay, I'm sorry. If you can, make sure it's not like super fucking haunted. You know. Video and rights. We should have listened to the dog and not Yeah, I think downstairs. that one was maybe some baloney, this but still kind of unsettling. <laughs> no, not more dogs sensing shit. <laughs> He's freaking out. <laughs> not the carpeted stairs. Oh. <laughs> oh, no. All right, come on. We're going to have to go and check. Leave him up here. Come on. Oh, it's the basement? No. What's that creepy-ass tree at the end? 
I'm, I'm swear I'm not trying to drag everyone. I just want to know. I got a lot of questions. Uh oh. Something broke off camera. Did they bring their dog with them? I would bring my dog with me. Unless the dog doesn't want to come down because it's way smarter. Oh, come on. Creepy room. What broke? Like a wine glass? Oh. Look at it. It's smashed on top of there as well. What? Do you think they staged this? Oh. I don't know. I don't know. That's good. My shoes are upstairs. He's a bit too calm for what just happened. I would be running more. I would be running farther. Are you kidding? No. They're in the kitchen. Yeah, all the doors are open and now they're closed. Oh, why are you going back? Forget the keys. It's probably best to just leave. And of course, I'm saying don't forget the dog. The dog did not go downstairs with them. The dog did not go downstairs with them. They should have known. They're going back, right? Like, why did he approach? I think his, like, partner or whatever was just like, nope, because you did not hear them after that. You did not. They were just like, bye. Two friends are inside a room recording someone who appears to be yelling at something. It isn't until they decide to approach this person that they see what it's it is happening. that they're yelling What's at. What's happening? What's happening in this what corner? They saw What's left happening? Them more disturbed than before. What's happening? This is no. what they caught. No. What is he talking? What are you talking to? Corner. I hate it. Ew. That's some black mold right there. I don't like it. I mean, it's definitely fake, but... Ew. Still, ew. You can't corner... You couldn't corner an entity like that. If you saw something like that going on in the corner, would you, like, try to boss it around? Would you try to girl boss a void around? I don't think you would. Yeah, it's it's like breathing. Ew. I would not. I would not corner that thing at all. <gasps> they kick it? Yeah, now that's how you know it's fake. No one would ever kick that. They would not. They would not. Time to peace out. Time to there turn right around. There appears to be a small, shadowy figure manifesting and disappearing at the same time. And they kicked it. I'll leave it to you to decide as to whether or not this was something paranormal. As always. He's just trying to vibe thoughts? in the corner. He's shy. I kicked a him. A security camera records a oh, child no. who's inside a crib when something downright creepy is captured. Babies see some stuff too. The child's too. mother had posted the following video as she doesn't know what to make of it. What happened? She was in the same room as her son when out of nowhere, he began to cry. Right? It wasn't until watching the footage that she was left disturbed. Like, congrats, the you're haunted writes, now. <laughs> I'm still trying to figure out if the camera glitched or something pushed my baby. Oh, okay. This is what was caught. What happened here? <laughs> what the hell? What? I'm sorry. <laughs> what? That has to be faked. That has to be faked. That kid would have whiplash. Oh, no way. No way. No way. The child that all of a sudden bodied. disappears from the camera's view. It appears that he was pushed over forcefully. The question is, though, what exactly had pushed him over? But there's still the cradle it. in the back continues to swing as the child vanishes from the frame suggesting that this wasn't a glitch. Oh. If it was, then the swing would have skipped a frame, just like the child had. But, as you can see, not a single frame uh, is skipped. I don't know. So then, if this wasn't a glitch, then what was it? 
No one else is seen in the room. I mean, it's really weird, but I don't know. And nothing appears to have pushed him over. As with all videos, it's up to you to decide if this is something paranormal or not. I feel like that not. kid would be like the child's way more distressed, but I don't know. But as always, feel free to share that what you think. That kid got pummeled into the fucking crib. <laughs> like there is Chucho no more Gutierrez child. Chucho is a nurse who works at a hospital a in seat. Veracruz, a city in Mexico. Oh, it's not three in the, the morning, hospital. And Chucho not is filming the his hospital. colleagues who are currently on break. But as he records them, Something disturbing is seen in the background. Where? Going a la tres de la mañana, cabrón. Mírala, jugando memes como siempre. Chica, no mames, no. Watching memes like always. There's someone in the back. Qué verga es eso. A child is seen walking down the hall, but there's something off about this child. Moments later, it reappears, but this time. Crawling on all fours. <laughs> Why did I laugh? Perhaps this might have been a it's patient of, of the funny. hospital who passed away. A spiritual cleanse might help with getting rid of those who've died. It's kind of funny when they lingers. crawl like that. It's isn't it? It's Ash? so cute when when ghosts do the little crawly. Um, I don't know. I don't know. It's probably fake, but uh, hospitals are just scary, anyways. They're just kind of. And her fiance are away creepy. from home. When their security camera inside the their crab, apartment yeah, captures basically turned into a crab. Ashley writes, "We were Can moving out of them? our apartment and caught this on our camera. My cat oh, won't take its eyes off animal. of it. This is what she caught. Not another animal. Can people just listen to their animals? I know, obviously, they were like away, but uh oh. Ooh, that cat isn't watching something very intently." What? Oh, what is that? Ew. Ew, it's got a little a little head. Oh, that's creepy. Ooh. Ooh, they're crawling. I don't know. Thanks, I hate it. Yeah. He's just saying hi to the kitty cat. He literally was like just leaning on the, the corridor like. There appears to be hi. someone or something peeking at the cat from behind the doorway. He's just doing but a little it does peek. so in a very strange manner. It seems to be peeking sideways with its hands gripping the doorway's frame What's on that? one side. But. As if that wasn't creepy enough. Yeah, this it is It seems weird. to ascend oh. and then disappear. Oof. Both Ashley and her fiance have no clue as to what this could have been. Did now, they move? This could be someone who had broken into their apartment, but there's something odd about this person. No, because they don't crawl and what on they the do ceiling. Seems physically impossible for anyone to do. It's a I good feel thing sick. Ashley's oh, moving no. out. As I doubt she'd want to stay there. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if this is real, but it's definitely not great to look at. Morales, Debbie, and her friends are tubing through a canal oh, when they capture this. something creepy on camera. What you see? The video oh, was why taken you on July 8th of 2018. But prior to this date, about five years ago, oh, yeah. someone had drowned in the same the, canal the that Morales is in. The hypermobility. Little does she know that she and her friends would not capture the something water. disturbing. Yeah, why are they? Take a look. What? It was an Aquaman? It was only after posting the video on Facebook and being told by viewers about this What's that, that she noticed. What's that? Viewers think that this might have been the ghost of the victim who had drowned. Others think or it's like that a this turtle. could something else. Perhaps it's a, a turtle. Creature. No one knows for sure, but it seems like more people believe that this might be the spirit of a deceased. Why would you think that course, immediately? What are your I don't thoughts? Know. Ghost or not? It looks like something covered in trash. Told me her I daughter don't know. had a friend she played with, thinking just an imaginary friend. Regardless, Audrey believe how fast her daughter's room would get messy. Even if it's not like anything, it's really unsettling to look back on video and be like, "Oh yeah, there was something creepy in the water. I did not see it when I was in the water," which maybe is a good thing, but you know, some kind of tarp. Yeah, I was thinking it might have been like a. Uh, like a plastic bag. 
the way it dissipates looks like mud to me. Yeah, I and think right they like kicked it. up something. So as her daughter was in the room talking to herself, Audrey decided to take a photo. Later that night, Audrey was skimming through the photos and oh. this is what was in the photo. You got an orb? Oh, what's that? What is that? What's that? Audrey also adds that if you look closely, there appears uh. to be a floating head by the closet doorway. Well, now, I, I know think some that's a shirt, are against but okay. This, but maybe you should know what that is. Help in finding out if your ew, child is ew, ew, yeah. a ghost. <laughs> but it's probably best to seek help elsewhere, as reaching out to the dead seems like a bad idea. What is that? I don't. Bailey mm, B okay. works at an old theater that is set to be haunted. Oh, no. Ooh. Although Bailey loves his job. That seems like a really cool thing to do, though. Like exploring an old theater. There's something about it he wish he could change. He often what? works at night, and he doesn't like this. For some reason, whenever Bailey's on he stage, like? he can't help but feel like there's someone there. It almost feels like there's someone watching him. Phantom of the It's opera? for this reason that he often records while working. But then one night, Bailey receives a notification that a sensor has detected motion inside the theater. Bailey writes, This is the scariest thing that has ever happened to me. Okay, I, I would like quit. to visit an old theater, this but not like this. Captured. Just to clarify. It's uh, 9 p.m. <laughs> During the daytime, I think. This is my life. This is my life. So I'm walking through the main stage. <clears throat> Here, I'll flip it. Somebody in the audience. Ghost light is on. <laughs> Ghost light. No one in here. Hello. Okay. Noise in the balcony. Oh, that's his friends. Those are his co workers. <laughs> Those are his co-workers, okay? He's like, listen, I'm going to dupe everyone into Bailey thinking that in I, total shock I work alone and was trying to night. process what he'd seen. Now, it could be I mean, that someone had spooky, broken in like, and decided to seat themselves on the balcony. But given the history of this place, unless they which levitate had or some shit, then... Bailey can't shake the thought of this being a ghostly encounter. But if anything, Bailey can rest assured that he isn't losing his mind. As what he captured on camera shows that someone or something was actually watching him. I, well, here the we go. Here's the thing. This is called scary compilation. So I guess it's not everything has to be paranormal. Like, yeah, that's still kind of unsettling if that's not planned. But also it's probably just two people. Okay. Um, here we go. Another dog. Maria, Another who dog had her warning. Dog acting very strange. It's Maria owners. Rice. It's been several days that my dog's been acting strange. She doesn't want to go several to her bed. Days? And she seems so scared to the point she starts shaking. So oh, tonight, I decided baby. to record her. And this is what I captured. You capture. Poor baby. Don't. She doesn't want to. Oh. Something's gonna traumatize this dog. Something's gonna fall. It's just like, no. Oh, the door in the back. I didn't see that. Uh oh. Creepy. For some reason, Maria's dog can't help but shake whenever she's near a specific room in the house. Yeah, so maybe you now, should take... Now, it's obvious that her dog is shaking out of fear. Maybe you should move the bed. But the real question Damn. is why. What might be the reason as to why she's behaving like this? Maria believes that a ghost might be responsible for her dog's strange behavior. <laughs> Given the belief that some pets can I mean... see things humans can't, could it be that she's actually seeing something? Now, what's even more creepy about this is that Maria claims to have caught the ghost on camera. According Where? to her, there appears to be a face <laughs> by the door. If you look closely, 
You'll That's be able silly. To see it. That's silly. What exactly was causing Maria's dog? I to like act how he's sticking way. his tongue out though. Like, here's the thing: if your dog for several days does not like to be in a certain area of the house, move the bed. Just making your dog scared for exactly. <laughs> That's the face. That's the face. Oh my god. Celia Santos had posted the following video on Facebook and states that something terrifying had occurred at a mall in Brazil. Oh, the video was taken at 2.30 malls. in the morning by a security guard who works there. He was sure that he was the only yeah, person no, thank inside you. until he saw the following. <laughs> the security guard had recorded this in the oh, hopes that people no, would no. believe him when telling them about this terrifying encounter. This is what he caught. It'd be a cool place to make a short film, though. Oh, you see some men going up the escalator. <laughs> Where are they going? Gotta get that BOGO. That's definitely just someone in the mall, though. But, like, on the other hand, it's like... If you were alone at a mall, like, in a mall, and you were supposed to be there by yourself, and you saw somebody or something, that would still be, like, not great. Not a great experience. Oh, the mannequins and malls, yeah. There appears to be a little girl yeah. on the escalator, who then disappears moments later. Now, this she could have been an corner. actual child, but what's a child doing inside a mall at two in the morning? <laughs> I can't think of anything to explain this. Just other doing than this being some a child. fucking shit, getting lost in the mall by themselves. I don't know. It's definitely like not great to look at, though. I think that's my scale. It's like I'm terrified of this, and then it's like okay. I don't believe this is like paranormal, but it's also like unsettling. Um, I guess I'm just a boring skeptic. I mean, I definitely call out things when I'm just like, well, that's kind of ridiculous. Um, yeah, there's just some things that are just kind of spooky looking. Who was accidentally locked inside. Now, what's even more strange about this is that the escalator was powered hmm. off during the time of this recording. Oh. Knowing oh, this, true. it doesn't make sense that the child was able to travel up smoothly without Power taking down. a single step. All in all, this one's pretty creepy. Yeah, I don't think I would like to be a bodyguard of any... Fernando Victor works at a train station. Type of desolate area. What he does there area. specifically is unknown. Powered off is the of clencher. Tasks, yeah, there they go. He always seems to have late night shifts. And who was phone? However, right? it was during a late night shift <laughs> When Fernando captures something terrifying on camera, Fernando and two other workers are walking beside a train that tunnels? isn't in operation. Ooh. When all of a sudden, he captures this without even noticing. Trains are inherently spooky, I think. The face. Yikes. <laughs> no, thank you. Someone or something yeah, no, we won't appears have to be any. looking it's at fine. Fernando as he records them. What do you think this might have been? Viewers believe that this may have been the ghost of someone who was involved in a railroad accident. I mean, it could now, just be somebody else. it could be that this was train. actually a person. That's still scary. But if it were, then how come this supposed person looks so creepy? I don't know. Damn, but drag this him. Is, looks too <laughs> dead to be alive. This person's just like, you just look too creepy. <laughs> Whoever. Yeah, people yeah, is, people do definitely camp out. Why why you look so her creepy? Father though? takes his wife and child to a theme park <laughs> and oh while God. recording them, captures something pretty creepy. The uh -oh. father states what? that after coming back from the theme park, his daughter told him that she was scared of going back. But what it happened? wasn't because she was afraid of the what rides, happened? but because of something else. Right. It was only after looking back at the footage he I'm took thinking. that he understood why his daughter was so afraid. It's like a very so blurred afraid. frame, too. This is what he caught. What'd he get? Be sure to look closely, or you'll miss it. I don't wanna. Show me. Haunted. Is this Disneyland in Hong Kong or something? Is this the Jungle Cruise? The Jungle Cruise. 
Did they see an animatronic? Right behind What's his going daughter, on? there appears to be a hand coming out of nowhere. Uh, well, yeah, I guess, yeah. Looks kind of edited it in there, but... I don't know. The scariest part about this, though, the is the hand away. that it seems to be reaching out to her. Yeah, but ew. something else was caught on camera yeah, that ew. also went unnoticed. Oh, two for... Earlier in the video, the Bogo. father is recording a boat that's passing by. Uh -huh. When out of nowhere, he captures this. Somebody on the boat? Is it Mr. Smiley? What do you get? Oh, something in the bushes? Is that a little hand? Ooh, that's a little hand. <laughs> Maybe it was a little monkey. I don't know. He, he literally, oh my God, I figured it out. He's just coming up for a fist bump and you're leaving him hanging. He's like, please. Okay, I won't. Like, he literally just wants, he wants that fist bump, and you're leaving him, exactly. He was like, all right, never mind. I'll get you on the fucking, I'll get you on the cruise. <laughs> I honestly have no explanation That's my theory. for this. I have an explanation, have and it's that. Questions. That's it, no questions. I can't help but think no that more this questions. might have been the That's same it. hand that appears later on. Because you left him hanging. What's even more creepy about this is that it seems to be trying to get the father's attention, or... Could it be that it was trying to get the daughters? I mean, it's kind of weird. There has yet to be an explanation I don't know what it is, for this. But, but as always, what yeah. are your thoughts? Uh, my thoughts are that the father is Ali rude Islam as hell. Is inside an abandoned house that's located in the middle of nowhere. See. There have only been a couple of people who've checked out this place, but the not empty a single Fanta person bottle? had caught anything as unusual as <laughs> Ali had when he paid a visit to this house. Mm -hmm. Ali is exploring the place. When all of a sudden, this happens. What happened? Bismillah. Noise coming from a room. Oh no. Sounds like a breaker. Squatters, yeah. A breaker going off or something? Nah, something moving. Which bash? Hmm. Interesting. Now it's worth mentioning that during the time of this recording, it was raining. It could be that oh, the strange yeah. noises were actually caused by the storm outside. Yeah, yeah. That could be the case. But what happens afterward, what if as it's Ollie not? exits the house, is beyond explanation. All right, show what he caught on camera is perhaps the creepiest encounter he's had. Be sure to pay close attention, or you'll miss it. What do you get? That was the guy. Yeah, it's probably a squatter. <laughs> He did get lit up by the lightning, though, which is kind of badass and spooky. Question <laughs> mark. Wait. Who is this uh, man-shaped shape? It could not be a man. Oh, it's probably a dude. <laughs> I mean, yeah, it's it's pretty spooky that he was illuminated by lightning, but I don't know. Question mark. Holly yeah. He doesn't know what to make of this. But if there's one thing that most viewers can agree on, of the man it's that this man. person or thing was most likely Again, observing squatter, Ollie yeah. during the time he was inside. If that's not creepy, then I don't know what is. Uh, it, I don't know. I feel Ryan like the hand Holtz fist writes, bump was creepier. So I was just sitting at home alone. Okay, here we the go. parents were out, and I kept hearing the weird sounds again. But this time, the weird I sounds. decided to record for a change. And this is what I caught. Really creepy. Okay. What'd you get? This is what I mean. Crazy shit. Is it like, is it like... Hello! 
lights flickering. I don't like it. Ooh. Oh my. No, that sucks. Oh. Oh no. Ew. Ew. He's just like going upstairs real quick. Phone's upstairs. Ooh, no. Ooh. Get out of the house. Leave the house. If I ever saw this, I would leave. Leave lights on. I, oh, I don't know where the front door is. Right. He just shat himself. Rightfully so. Rightfully so. Right. The drawers are full. Don't go up there. What the fuck? He's just like, nope. Gotta check. I. Uh, a saw Malik. Is that Ralphie by any chance? Hello. Hello, hello. Perhaps this might have been a stranger who broke in. Intruder yeah, in or that ghost. case, you it's should not be going up the stair. I mean, scary, yes, to have somebody in your house like that, but um, I wouldn't have followed. Once again, squatter, yeah, or, or, or somebody who broke into their house, house, which is not, not great. Ellen Melbergstead is on her way to a doctor's right, we're, appointment we're at 12. and we're is taking a it. shortcut through a park to get there. The video takes place in Sweden during the winter time, so it's mostly Ooh, dark during Sweden. the day. As she's on her way to the hospital, Spooky. Ellen takes out her phone and begins to record. But little does she know that she's about to capture something downright creepy. She get a Check snowflake. Out. She get talks about seeing her psychologist oh no she was just trying to make a instagram story Ooh, that's a raccoon that's a raccoon that's a little guy do they have raccoons in sweden or a bird it looks like a bird that's a bird. It was only after viewers had pointed this out that Ellen had noticed it. Cat or bird, there yeah. There appears to be a figure I think it's a peeking bird. at Ellen from behind a you tree. You can see the beak. That's a fucking it's bird. As to who or Why is this at number 12? Bizarre bub. You need to put this back in the, I don't know, the 30s or something. This is clearly a bird. Um. <laughs> I just really love dragging just dumb shit. Anywho, what this might let's have go. Been. Let's but go. Viewers think that this could have been a ghost. <laughs> exactly. There he is. Whatever it might have been. It's the ghost. Ellen will most likely be taking a different route from now on. One without birds? Maybe don't walk through the forest if you don't want to see a bird. Cell Luna is conducting a paranormal okay. investigation at a place where human <laughs> remains were found. The so site great. has been abandoned for a while. You should and not is known go to in be there. a hot spot for paranormal activity. <sighs> while checking out one of the rooms inside the building, this happens. A fucking asthma attack? Jesus Christ. Just, just huff it all in. It's definitely a breeze. Oh my god, are these in reverse order or something? Dios mío. Okay, it's the breeze. Later on, Grisel goes oh outside God. and finds something pretty disturbing. The hell is that? Oh. What is this? What is that? Don't pick it up. Why would you pick it up? Why would you pick it up? Why? I'm not oh sure my if God. picking up the bone was a good idea. Do you think? Because what happens Holy next shit. might have been the result of having done so. Come on now. Come on now. Oh no. That's awful. For real. Like, okay. I'm sorry. Clearly they're doing it for our YouTube channel, but like going to a place that you know had human remains for one. 
to, oh, I'm going to see this thing and pick it up, like, with my bare hands, like. Okay. Good, good luck being cursed forever, I guess. It's not clear what cursed. happened here, but whatever occurred, Don't. I'm sure it wasn't good. I was given by the history of this place. She holds on to it for so long. Just clutches Facebook it, really. Facebook user Yingyi Vong writes, So something crazy happened right, tonight. Here we go. My security motion camera activated footage. security camera turned on. Yield. I grabbed my phone to see a live feed of what was happening outside. I couldn't believe what I saw. Let's see. Oh. Taking a little ride. Oh, it's kind of a live direction for that. Ooh, where's it going? <laughs> no, Talk no. about Ghost Rider. No, no. If the tricycle did he hadn't say that? Turned, did he literally say that? that moved it. Talk about Ghost Rider. <laughs> oh Christ! I mean, I'll take it. I but, guess, but as you can see, that doesn't seem to be the case. Where's it going? <laughs> yeah, it, it turns. It has like a destination. <laughs> Susie Somori lives in a three-story house with oh. lots of stairs and several rooms. It looks haunted Out as of shit. all the rooms, there's one in particular that she stays away from. The one that looks on the third floor. Creepy there's a as large, hell. Vacant room with the painting of a sun on one of its walls. She doesn't know why, but there's something about this painting that makes her feel very uneasy. It might be the ambience <laughs> of the room, but she can't. They were like. This room once belonged to somebody who likes sublime. <laughs> can't help but feel like the Bunnies. painting is responsible for the dreaded feeling she gets whenever she walks in. <laughs> Mr. Smiley, yeah. So, thinking it's all in her head, <laughs> she tries her best ring. to Come ignore on. this feeling. But then, <laughs> one night, Susie encounters something <laughs> that scared funny. the living daylights out <laughs> of her. Because it is. I feel Susie like it is. Susie is home alone when she it's captures like the following on camera. Oh, what's she find? I, I don't practice Santeria. I ain't got no crystal ball. That's what I said. Maybe they did practice Santeria. That's why it's haunted. Oh, great. I love I love world building all on my own. What's that? What's on the floor? What is that? Susie ends the video there. But little does she know that if you had a million dollars, one well, day, I Susie's I niece is playing all. inside the room, and while spying on her, she captures this. It's happening. Oh, when kids have like, oh no, not the imaginary friend, not the imaginary friend. You want this or do I keep it? It's literally like a sublime CD. It's just like, I don't want this. Do you want this? Her niece appears to be talking to the painting as though she's having a conversation with it. She's talking Susie directly to like the this. painting. No. And so she asked her as to who she was talking to. No. This no, I said. don't like that. Did you like him? Yes. Gilbert's like one of Gilbert. my best friends. Where did he come from? I don't know. Man, you still live here. I, I knew it was a man. It's a sublime fan. Like I can see him in my mind's eye. Is he, is Gilbert friendly? Does mean? Uh oh. What does he say? Oh God. You know, you know. Susie doesn't know what to make of that. That end now just makes me think it's like, this is some evangelical type of weird psyop i don't pray and this is why you should pray like come on come on i mean it's still like a painting they have in their house i guess it seems that her niece had befriended gilbert i liked my story better she's made an imaginary friend but the thing said by the so-called friend <laughs> the doesn't emoji. sit well with susie <laughs> And so, she decides to spy on her once more. <laughs> Emoji. But this time, she captures something even more strange. Singing her and banging on the floor? Her appears to be looking for something underneath the floorboard. 
Oh no. It was only after her niece had fallen asleep and they that she Bible decided to investigate it. the spot. She checks it out and ends up finding something disturbing. Take she a look. Found. Is it a Bible? Did I just call it? It's a sublime CD. God, I wish it was. I mean, this is definitely like planted. I just want to know what they put underneath this water part. <laughs> oh my God. Not even secured to the floor. Literally not even secured to the floor. <laughs> oh no. What is that? Slab. Oh, it's a Ouija board. Oh, for fuck's sake. I mean, it does look really fucking old, though. Hmm. Oh, Gilbert's on it! Oh my god, it's Gilbert. I kind of like the way they painted him. He looks like a little clown son. Needless to say, Susie was speechless. What's more strange about this is the Ouija I love board how itself. clean it looks. If you look I love closely, how clean it looks, and they're just like, oh, oh, we have to uncover it from the dirt. It's so dirty. Like, no, it's not. It is a cool board, though. I will say, like, I really do like the sun and the moon. They look very nice, but. Uh, the board appears to have the same painting of the sun that's on the wall. This can't be a coincidence. It's kind of weird. I don't, Susie I don't understand is certain what's going that the board is somehow connected to the painting. They definitely painted that. This unsettling discovery has these led Susie into were researching like, the history of her home. These people were like, we're going to remodel this room soon anyways. So we're going to like paint the sun on the wall. And like, they literally like storyboarded this. Like, <laughs> I'm like, how far, how much farther does it go? Yeah. Like, after much research, come on, she found this. The modern version got no nose piercing yeah, gift. The house from 1916 and it was built in 19. I mean, it's definitely an old house, house though. Still one of the first families to live <laughs> in this house. As you can see, there are six people present in the photo. I'm looking at the English census records. I found that the father would be called John. Hanging the off the ledge of my house. The the balcony has a daughter, Dorothy. The birth of a little boy called Gilbert was also registered here in 1911. Why is so why is she talking like she's, she's a Victorian child? I don't sure understand. He's not with the rest of his family in the photo. What they did to him. Somebody in the window. Oop. Something really terrible happened to him at the hands of his own family. The word is part and they just is saying the hey in the window situated in the house that's his room gilbert was the name of a child who used to live in her house and whose room has the painting of the sun uh -huh. which seems to have been named after him he has, she has a yet nose to post piercing more info on the history of her home this cannot be an old For painting now, she continues researching in the hopes of putting an end to this mystery is gilbert the supposed <laughs> ghost that talks to her niece or Literally a nose piercing else? on the sun. Oh my god, that's kind of funny. A group of friends are at a fair, they were riding bored. a pirate ship ride, when oh, one of them captures the something disturbing on camera. Not the fair. The person who caught this writes, Before coming to this fair, I've heard stories of a woman who had tragically died after falling off from one of the rides here, Oof. but that was many years ago. This video was taken in 2008 I mean, at around 10 p.m. I feel like most fair rides are very dangerous so this is what was like captured. that would happen yeah sure right to pay i'm just close like attention nope. to the background nope. or you'll miss it i don't want to <laughs> whenever they say pen pay attention to the background i'm like don't just show me show me what i must see because this was filmed on a potato in the year 2009 <laughs> or something um where am i looking see anything they probably just got like a carny on the video or something where is it they're gonna make us watch this whole video of this guy's shirt before they show us oh at first I missed it there are four people sitting next to each other 
Okay, great. But then a few seconds later, there's one last person. She is next to them. <laughs> Perspective. You gotta be kidding me. Cause she's literally right next to them. This is so dumb. Yes, because this guy cannot hold a camera as we can see. I mean, she is over there. It appears that the passenger on the left has disappeared. No. They're probably like sinking in the, the seat or something. The has no idea as to who she is and still doesn't know to this day. However, he can't help but think that this might have been the woman God, we have who to had watch the entire clip of screaming people, ago. right? Viewers think so too and have even pointed out that her face looks injured in a couple of frames. Now that's creepy. Because it's old. Of course, what do you think? Was yeah, a ghost you can, caught on camera? Anyone's face can look injured if you pause it if it was taken As out of fucking potato. Feel free to let me know what you think. Why are these degrading? My husband works nights at a high school. I feel like the older ones were like better. He's always told me it's been haunted and he has seen and heard weird stuff. But with the schools being closed since COVID, mm. things have been a little strange recently. Last night, they had some construction workers in and one of the guys was freaking out because he said someone kept Question whispering is, in his was ear there really only three and he people didn't on seem the to ride together when he said that the school think was haunted. So. I honestly feel like like he was holding the camera like down here. So there's no way he would be able to catch someone sitting like three seats like away because he started out like holding the camera up here and then it like moved. So I don't know. I don't know if I believe that one. Um, yeah. Later, <laughs> like, one of my husband's colleagues right next saw them. something in his peripheral vision a couple of times. What, so what are we about to see now? We kept seeing it. This is right. caught on camera. It's like if they got seated with a random lady, of course they wouldn't remember them. Ooh. What's ooh? This is that one kid who slept in class and nobody woke up. Oh, he's like hiding behind in the chair. In all seriousness, though, this photo remains a mystery. But I can't help but think that Don't the history like of the school might give an explanation to this image. All in all, this photo is pretty creepy. I like how he ends every like one that's kind of underwhelming Emacs with just like yeah it's pretty creepy though. Who explores abandoned places. Like, yeah, Not too is. long ago, he explored an abandoned hospital in Taiwan Why? where he encountered strange activity. He decides to revisit that same hospital Aww, in the hopes Sponge of capturing more activity. And he actually does. But it may have been more than he expected. The children's hospital? <sighs> Mm -mm. I don't fuck with abandoned buildings, especially hospitals, especially hospitals, like, eh. Oh my God. Oh my God. <laughs> There's no doubting that Emacs was left feeling spooked, but all know. of this pales in comparison to what happens Maybe next. a little drafty. Yeah, I'm good, right? Like, what are you doing? We found a walker with corroded batteries. Oh my, <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I like this commentary, though. Like, yeah, you're going to an abandoned hospital to run down everything. Gonna be some not great things there. No. Ooh. They're inviting him in. They're like, oh, if they're cold, you're cold. I'll let them in. How are you going to say it's not made by wind, but then there's like a giant window? <laughs> like it probably was. But yeah, abandoned places like I do not need to be in, I will say. Oh my God. Um, 
Yeah, I would go. I would just go. Help. <laughs> oh, he's got a little a, re a little reader, too. Time to leave. They're literally opening the door for him. Like, let's go. <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah, buddy, you might want to go. They are quite literally showing you the door. Coming back to this place might have <laughs> upset the ghost that yeah. haunts it. Yeah. Slamming the door repeatedly kind of makes it seem like it was irritated by Emax's return. Yeah. With activity like this, it, was like, Get it the makes hell you out. wonder if a poltergeist was present or if it was something else. If you caught something creepy <laughs> on camera or if there's any ghost videos you'd like yeah, me to ghosts. check out and include in the next compilation, you can send them over to scaryvideos444 at gmail.com. Good to know. That being said, let's get back to the video. Scaryvideos444. <laughs> Marlene White All right, top is inside five. her let's bathroom go. when she captures something out. really creepy on camera. Oh, that's not Marlene it. writes, please tell me that I'm not crazy. That's not Here's it. the video she posted, along with the text-to-speech voice that she uses to explain what's going on. Is that a baby? What the hell is this? I only have one baby at my house today. The rest of them are with grandma. You can clearly hear my baby in the living room crying. It's an alternate. It's an alternate. It's an alternate. They're here. <laughs> I mean. I was on the toilet when I felt like something was watching perfect, me. Perfect, perfect place I've been to on be edge ever since I took when a you picture see that, and I my would dad assume. was behind me by the door. So I decided to turn the camera on and record dot this is not my dad. I don't know what it is. Ooh. I don't like the stance it I has. I know you've seen it move before and after I gasped. Who are you? No, I would not want a an answer. Hello. God, that's so creepy. Now, it kind of looks like someone is standing inside. Maybe it's one of her children. But Marlene disproves this notion by showing us what it would actually Here's look like thing. if one of her children were standing inside. A kid did not st a, does not quick, stay so that I still. Something, please. I can't Shut believe the they stayed in the bathroom. And if that really was something they saw, I would be... Okay. Yeah, exactly. Perfect place for fucking shitting and pissing your pants. It's an alternate. Yeah, see, kids do not... Kids don't have a stance. Who was stanced up in the bathroom? I would be out of there in a heartbeat. That was not my babies in the shower. Please just stop. There's no way. It's kind of creepy. There's no way. I would never get in that scary thing. I'm so scared. Time to move. Marlene has no idea as to what this might be, but viewers can't help but think that this might have been a ghost. Time to move. But what do you think? I think ghost it's time to move. Or illusion. I think it's time to go. Pack it up. <laughs> yeah, you no thoughts, thank you. Then you'll probably want to skip this one. As what's captured in it is just Are we, are we actually going to give me a haunted doll? The girl is doll, playing with her or... doll when the following happens. Like, I mean, the chills. Yeah, that's just like is weird. Like, here's the thing. I When I said we were going to do paranormal videos, I was just like, you know, there's some that are just creepy and they might be fake, but they're still kind of fucking effective. And I don't know what the hell that was, but I don't like it. I don't like it. Yeah, that's a top five. That's absolutely top five material that here's here we go, um, which makes me concerned for this number four doll video. Uh, Be sure to pay close attention to the doll or I you'll don't. miss it. I don't. The doll does not have my attention. How is this video to Will not have my soul. Good. OK, thank you. Okay. Yeah, thank you so much, Kelly. You are good. Kelly what? Ew. The hospital one too. Yeah, it's just like uh, abandoned places. No. The kid noticed. 
Yeah. As she plays with her toy, the doll moves its head all on its own. She said something like it like whispered in now, her ear it or could something. Be that the doll has a built-in feature that allows it to move. Maybe. But based on how she reacted upon seeing this, it seems like this wasn't a feature built into the doll. Viewers seem to agree and suggest that the doll is haunted. Oh yeah, of course but it as could. Always, I'll let you be the judge of that. I don't know. The thing is that like the, the video doll we were about videos to see was posted by Anne have been like very underwhelming. Um but yeah, the kid was like definitely they they were they were definitely uh what is the word? Eating the scene. Like they were they were giving a good performance there. Andy Winehouse. Because you can tell when kids are freaked video, out. Recorded this. Andy hey, Winehouse. This is my family home. I grew up here. And we've never had a single experience like this. Uh oh. I I don't know what is going on. What did you do? I'm getting a lot of comments saying I'm doing it for views. <laughs> and I'm doing it for likes. And I, I promise you I am not. I like that he's got to mention that at the top. Don't want to. <laughs> Please I like and subscribe. Knows what this is. Please reach out. I don't care if it's in a comment or privately, just please reach out. What? And please just help me. It's I don't Mr. Smiley. Like when she gets home, I can't afford a hotel for the night. We're doing a remodel in the bathroom. And everything's just going to right now. And I'm not trying to be dramatic about this. Which what? But I have no idea what to do. Where? Can you please show? In the comments all day has just been freaking me out. Milking it, my guy. I think this is just in my head, but I keep listening to it over and over and over again. Is there somebody, please? Somebody, please reach out with an answer. Is Help it the wall? Help. Like, what? Show. As you can tell by the video, Andy is in total shock and cannot process the strange incident that took place inside his home. What? Luckily, he was able to record this incident in case no one believed him. Andy writes, I don't know what to do at this point. Things got weird last night, Oof. and I had to sleep in my car. I am safe, but I am not doing well, and I need help. This is what he caught. What? Come here. Come here. Come here. The alternates? Oh my god, it's the alternates! Heard my own voice calling me from the other room. What is this? Fuck out of here. Oh, Andy no. Can rest assured that he's not losing his mind as the video shows that someone or something is mimicking his own voice. <laughs> the alternates. Dude. It's up to you to decide as to whether or not something supernatural was caught on camera. Andy is certain that he did. I don't but know. For now, I don't like that. The video that. remains a mystery and is left open to interpretation. Well, uh,. That's scary. Um, I'm scared. Yeah, we're all we're all just like shitting and pissing and crying over here. Um, but yeah, we were watching the Mandela uh, catalog earlier and it had to deal with, you know, doppelgangers and alternates and like hearing your own voice and seeing yourself and like, oh, fuck out of here with that shit. That shit is too much okay yeah that's number three that is rightfully a number three spot for that video i feel um i had a little nephew once told me some scary stuff he saw and he definitely didn't even know what he was talking about so i do, do think kids have some sort of higher ability to see things in my opinion yeah i feel like kids report a, a lot of weird stuff that's for sure um yeah ugh, ugh, nah. nope BRB throwing up. BRB crying and shitting and pissing. Um Yeah. That's fucked. All Laura right, number Honigan 2. Posted the following video number after two? capturing footage of something creepy on her baby monitor. Her daughter is resting in her crib baby monitor when creepy. Laura all of a sudden gets a bad feeling. She promptly runs to her daughter's so my room dead and sees that kid, she's okay. as my mom says. Oh god. But little does she know that something was captured like on her frequency. baby monitor before she had entered the room. It's worth mentioning that no one was upstairs at the time of this recording. What is this? Laura writes, I'm f***ing terrified. This is what was caught. 
Oh, I'm so, oh, I don't even want to see. I don't even want to look. Ooh, no, no. Uh -uh. It appears that a pair of legs were caught on camera. Here's a follow-up video Laura had room. made in response to this creepy footage. There was legs that were walking. It looked like legs that were walking out of her room. Yeah. And her window is locked. There's no other entrance. Oh, to legs, that room, yeah. Literally. And you never seen nothing going in. It just was legs going out. You seen me come in, come out, and then you see those legs go out, and then you see me come so upstairs to get bad. Her and go out. Laura doesn't know what to make Ew. of this. What's strange about this is that whoever, or whatever this was, appears to have come out of nowhere, as no signs of entry were seen in the daughter's room. So many creepy things it picked up on baby monitors. It could be that squatter was hiding in the house, given the fact that most squatters tend to hide in places like the attic. Perhaps that's where they came from. Can you imagine? But of course, I'll leave it to you to figure this one out. Can you out. imagine just having was someone living in your attic, or basement, or some other ancillary room that you have, or you just don't know? It's still scary as shit. Like, yeah, it might not be paranormal on that sense, but like, uh, it's scary. She's supposed to have twins and didn't. I was talking to the wall saying I was talking to my brother. Ugh. Nope, nope, nope. Nope, nope, nope. I'm backing out of that. Yeah. All right. Yeah, I don't... See, this is definitely, like, technically scary because it's, like, a safety issue also. Um, so, next up is number one. This is the last Calm video. Camera. Or had something else been I wonder, captured? I wonder what's going to be number one. Rewatch the clip and decide for yourself. I don't want to rewatch the legs. I don't. Number the following one. footage shows someone who's by himself inside a gym. Okay. When something terrifying happens... Emily Ruiz, who suggested the video, writes, Words cannot explain this disturbing footage. The person in the video had obtained this recording from the gym and sent it to a friend who we hear speaking in the video. Okay. This is what was captured. What? What happened? Some very strange things. What happened, Papi? It was a machine. It was COVID. Mira, explíqueme eso, sí, eso dos cuerdas y yo qué voy a hacer, mami, la otra quieta, o sea, no podemos decir que es el aire, ni que hay ventilación, ni nada de esas sí, vainas, eso es como y en plena luz del día, ¿quién dice que estas maricadas pasan en plena luz del día? No, mire, la luz. No, he doesn't realize they're moving. Mire, mire. Oh, he doesn't mire. realize it. Ahí, mira eso, mira eso. That's a medicine ball, isn't it? Sí. Sí, parece eso es una energía muy mala. Yeah, I would, yeah. Ay, Dios oh, mío, no. ¿qué le pasó? Mamá, mira. Oh, no, he's like, no, you get back no, in the gym. No, eso no es normal. Sí, yo eso sé no que... es no, that's normal. Not normal. Sí. Oh, wow. Those who've seen the footage were left unsettled by this terrifying encounter. You get at dragged? The the video, we can see that someone or something is peeking at this person. This is something you might have oh, missed. Oh no, a little friend. Now, it's worth mentioning that another camera had recorded this from a from different before? angle. By looking at oh, this specific footage, we can see that the facility has open windows. Yeah. It could be that the wind from outside the room was causing the ropes to move on their own. But if that Maybe. were the case, the medicine then other ball. things in the room should have moved as well, especially the towel on the box, which appears light enough to move just a bit, but it doesn't. The wind could also explain the oh, ball's movement. Oh, yeah, because it's not moving then. But mind you, this is a medicine ball. It would take more than just a gust of wind to yeah, be able to move heavy. something this heavy. <laughs> what? But what's even more baffling about this footage what is else? how the person gets dragged across the floor. It could be that he was doing this on his own, moving his body in such a way to make it seem as though he were being dragged. However, a closer look at this scene shows that he was jerked in a forceful manner, which is almost impossible to do on one's own. Mm. Other things in the video remain questionable, such as lights turning off on their own, or whatever this is. I'll leave it to you to come up with your own conclusion I on this don't footage. Know. Cause that's like here's the thing that really gets me. It's the medicine ball moving. Cause those things are fucking heavy. They are they are heavy. They do not just roll across the floor. I don't know. 
I have a huge library in my uh, first floor, and there's a huge wall. I've been scared after watching that Korea movie. <laughs> so, yeah. Wait. Korea movie? Which one? Because uh, there's, there's a couple. There's a couple that I was thinking of recently. I was thinking of uh, a cult. That was a pretty good one. I know a bit of visual effects, and it definitely it looks real. I don't think it's rotoscope. Yeah, it's it's a weird sequence of things to happen. Let me. Oh, there's bonus. Footage. There's Feel bonus? free to let me know what you think. Bonus. Hold on, I want to see what Katrina the bonus is. Katrina Pariso had taken a photo of herself while being at home with no one else around. She uh -oh. had the house to herself, or, or so, so she thought. She thought. <gasps> What? It was after having Shut taken up. a selfie I... that she realized that she wasn't alone. I knew it. I knew this it. This is the photo she took. <laughs> that definitely deserves to be number one, right? Ooh, what's that in the back? Now, at first glance, what's nothing that? unusual stands out. What is out. that? That is, until you brighten up the image and see that someone is behind her. Katrina swears that she was home alone when she took this, but apparently Well, apparently she not. Wasn't. Katrina believes that a ghost had photobombed her picture, and she <laughs> also thinks that this may have been her brother who had passed away years ago. She what? isn't sure if that's him, though, that's as it appears to have long hair, which he didn't have. She has yet to figure oh, out what this. Might I don't have like been. it. But one thing's for sure, though. This, this is the bonus. Has left Katrina spooked, and still keeps her up at night. Yeah. 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 I'm sorry. If I ever took a picture of myself and there was anything as disturbing as that in the background, woof. No, no, no. Wow, we made it through all of them. We made it. We're so brave. Um, time to move out. That's literally my that's my diagnosis for everything going on in this um in these videos. Is that it's time to go. You need to go. Um, oh my god. Some of those were like really weird. I gotta say, yeah, I don't know. I, I feel like that gym one was especially uh, just kind of weird. Just kind of weird. Anyways. Oh, Lord. Anywho. Yeah, some of these things are very much just like things that get picked up on video. And then some of it, it's just like, I don't know. It just fucking looks weird and I don't like it. I, I dislike it. Uh, but that was a pretty good compilation. As as far as like paranormal compilations go, uh, that was that was pretty good. Um, but yeah, I don't know. I don't know. The gym one and the hospital one were my top nopes. Oh, what what were my top nopes? Let me see. Um, anything involving an animal. Uh, I have to say, absolutely no. Um. Yeah, that last one with the photo is kind of not the best thing for me to ever see, but yeah. The gym guy, the way his leg gets pulled. Yeah, I, I kind of want to look at it again. It's just we need to we need to have a another playback because he he looked like he just got like ripped from the. Oh, I hate that. He, just, he looks like he just got ripped from the floor. And you can kind of see his other foot underneath him, um, kind of like pushing him a little bit. So, those ropes look really heavy too. So I feel like a breeze wouldn't be able to like blow them around, you know? Uh, yeah, you can't fake that on your own. It was like a rug. Yeah. Y en plena luz del día, ¿quién dice que estas maricas pasan en plena luz del día? Let's see. No. Mire. La luz. Ugh. Yeah, the thing in the, the hallway, Mire. I also didn't see the first time. Mire. Ahí. Yeah, the, Mire the eso. kettlebell moving. Mire eso. No. Uy, he had an appropriate reaction. He was like, I can't get the fuck out. Eso es pesadísimo. Sí. Sí, parece que eso es una energía muy mala. Ay, Dios mío, ¿qué le pasó? He, he really is getting dragged. Here, let me turn the volume off and maybe like, uh, playback speed. Here, here we go. Deep detective work that we're doing. So this is 
slowed down by half. We're going to see this guy. He wants to go get his shit. Okay. And then the kettleball. I went back too far. Sorry. <laughs> I don't want to miss anything. Yeah, yeah, he's not, he's definitely not pushing his body. Like, it's so weird. So he's gathering his stuff. He's, he's rightfully being like, actually, no. That's not right. And here we go. His leg gets pulled and he's moving. Like, he's actually getting dragged. What? What? Wait. So you're telling me that there are gym ghosts? They literally are. Imagine a, a gym ghost. Well, we don't have to imagine. Here's probably what it would look like. Um, apparently, they're going to kick your ass. Apparently, they're just like, no, we're dragging you. Oh, my God. Yeah, his leg was snatched. He He was taken by the leg. And he's kind of limping on the way out. He definitely got, like, hurt. Let me see. Hold on. I'm very. Uh, it's just such a weird movement out of nowhere. The kettleball is still rolling, too. Oh. That's so weird. Uh, that's so weird. I don't know. Yeah, he, yeah, he definitely got yanked. He's, he's like limping away. Interesting. Interesting. Um, yeah, that's really weird. I feel so validated for not going to gyms. Yeah, right. There might be a gym ghost. You never know. Um, let me see. The way his body moves, it looks like some strange strength. Yeah, it really does look like a gym ghost. Hold on. Let me put the jazz on. Hit you with the jazz a little bit. Yeah, his weight is on the other leg. Uh, there's no way he could launch himself out like that. I really Oh my god. Thank you. Thank you for gifting that subby to Bat's pajamas. I appreciate that. Thank you, thank you. Um Yeah, there was no way he could have really done that. I don't think. It's really weird. Very strange. Uh some people are so hyped up on smelling salts. I don't know if people do smelling salts for the gym. Um yeah, aggressive gym poltergeist don't surprise me at all. Yeah, exactly. Like, there is some tough-ass gym ghost that's just like, you didn't re-rack. That's probably what's he, what he's mad about. He's just like, you didn't re-rack. And you didn't wipe down your equipment. It's kind of rude. Um, but yeah, that that one was a... That's a pretty good number one, I will say. Um, especially since there were, like, two angles for it. And I don't know... There's really not a lot that can be explained with that one, I gotta say. Um, interesting, though. Very interesting. Um, I think that's a, that's a good cap for this evening. I believe we've uh, we've been we've been spooked enough, and now I'm gonna definitely have a great night's sleep, undisturbed, no nightmares at all. Um, but yeah. I think this was fun. Fun in the way that I was just like almost terrified for like the beginning parts of it. And then it got like progressively funnier. I don't know. Some of them are funny and then some of them are still like, I don't know what's going on here. Um, clean up your gym equipment. Always. Exactly. Maybe it was the previous maintenance personnel. <laughs> yeah, maybe. Moral of the story is sanitation is of, of utmost importance. True, true. Yeah, they're they're basically just trying to keep their gym like together and nice. But I don't know. Did he really have to drag him by the leg like that? God dang. Yeah, seriously, like that is what happens when you don't re-rack. Um anyways, yeah, I'll I'll be posting all of these videos in the Discord underneath the cryptid sleepover section. Uh so if you wanna look into anything else that we've looked at, 